Hi there. Let's talk about uh, week number eight here in our, our course. What we're going to do in week eight is exactly what I'm doing right now. We're going to get out in the field. We're going to map our data. Let me show you something right here. I'm mapping my data right now. Um, I've got uh, I've got a smartphone with me, okay, and I'm I'm tracking where I'm going. I'm also recording the uh, location of some of these shrubs around here because I want to figure out if there's a difference between the north-facing slope and the south-facing slope. And also, I'm collecting a couple of waypoints here. Uh, in other words sort of a, a, a virtual point, um, not leaving anything on the ground, but a, a point that I can map and tie things to later on, like a photograph or a video like this one or something like that. I've also got a GPS unit because one of the other things I'm doing is I'm collecting a track. Now I can do that with a GPS unit, I can do it with a smartphone, I can do it with a probe. Um, there's a lot of different ways that I can collect data nowadays. So we want to concentrate on collecting data and how to do that but also what kind of formats can we bring into a map because it's not enough just to collect data what we want to do is map it we want to map it because we want to look at patterns relationships trends like these north facing slopes versus south facing slopes or pH along streams how does it vary or tree height and tree species or litter does it vary by the busyness of the street or proximity to schools or whatever so we want to look at the spatial patterns now sometimes there is no spatial pattern for the things that you're mapping but that's just as informative I believe as a spatial pattern hey, look I've even got a geotech shirt on cool anyway that's what our focus is going to be this week is the value of field work we're going to read about about that and then secondly how to gather collect and then map and analyze and share the data that you're that you're collecting on a commonly viewable map or a set of mapping tools so let's get started thanks